Welcome to Vlogtober, week one. Hi guys, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Priya and I basically make a fool of myself on the internet. And today is the 1st of October, I can't believe it. This year seems to have just flown by. There's only three months left to this disaster that has been 2020. I can't wait to be in 2021 already. Well, mm, not really because in 2021 I turned 25, which scares me uh, a lot. So there's been this thing going on on YouTube for the past 10 years, I think. During the month of October, people vlog their day and usually post every single day i'm not going to do that because that would be a lot of pressure on me and also i don't do stuff every single day so i don't want to post two or three minutes video of me just rambling about the shampoo that i bought or something like that so what i'm going to do is vlog every single day or every time i do something and then post once a week so during the whole month of october <clears throat> i have a cat in my throat that's something we say in French. So during the whole month of October, I'm going to post actually twice a week, every Wednesday, my regular upload, and either every Friday or every Saturday. So I really hope you enjoy Vlogtober, and I hope I'm not going to, to want to die, because even when I post once a week, it's already sometimes overwhelming for me, so... So today is the perfect example of a boring ass day into my life. I have two classes today, but somehow, because the schedule is all messed up, I finish at 7 p.m. I have labor law and the second one is international mobility which I really liked last week because I went yes I'm trying to keep my attendance not high because I'm mediocre I don't get to have high expectations but I try to keep my attendance like 50 50 and that's the reality of a student I think I'm not a good example to follow I don't know if there are younger people watching me but um, don't follow my example it's not it's not an, an example to follow I think Sorry, I don't want to be a role model. I just want to be the mediocre average me Voilà, donc on a été boire quelque chose avec Nicole <laughs> Ce sera sur le premier jour de Vlogtober Say hi Hi, everybody. Hi. My classes are done. I'm heading back home. And today is actually the first day where it's not compulsory anymore to wear a face mask in the streets, except in busier one. And you still have to wear them, of course, in public transportation and at school. Is it a sign that the pandemic is getting better? I don't think so. But it's a sign of hope. So there's that. Oh, I thought those were going to be crunchy. Oh. I'm frustrated now. Voilà, Andrea et Elma, les grandes organisatrices de cette soirée. Look at this. T'es contente Marina, elle est happy Oh Andrea, à quoi les jours comme les ballons Il est trop beau Alma, tu vas aller dans Top Chef bientôt Ouais Mais de ouf, un petit gâteau Inch'Allah Et voici Maria Hello Qui vient d'avoir son petit diplôme Congratulations to her Andrea with her handbag Le pauvre Help me. We love this. We love this animal. On October 3rd, he asked me what day it was. It's October 3rd. It's the weekend. Na 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 na. 
So today is actually going to be very busy for Saturday because one of my best friend Ellen and I are planning to go on a trip next week to celebrate our half birthday and the reason why we celebrated it this year more than the other years was because we didn't get to have a real birthday this year due to the quarantine so I think we deserve it but the hard part is we have to plan it and now because of COVID I don't know what the European Union did it was because they wanted to be one soul they created a an interactive map we have to refer to but j'arrive maman it's truly the most confusing thing ever because every zone is marked either as green light orange orange or red and you would think that if the zone is mar marked as red you can't go but no it's not strictly forbidden to go it is strictly unadvised strictement déconseillé but i'm still not going to go to those red zones because we come back in belgium you need to quarantine and do a covid test and i can't afford to quarantine right now because i have classes to attend to after that i need to redo my cv redo my lettre de motivation and start to apply for internship because i need to find an internship asap and also of course i need to edit my videos because i don't know how i'm going to post twice a week during october because I, I I did nothing. Vas-y, <sighs> march. Today's my half birthday, so we're going on a day out. I don't know where, but it's going to be fun. So today I'm 24 and a half. And now we're going to an event which is held only today with vintage clothes. The line is huge, but it's going pretty fast. Now we stopped at Quick to get something to eat because we're basically starving and we got so many beautiful tasty things, look. Bon app! Bon app! I just came back home and I realized that we had a little guest over when I wasn't there and it was unexpected but you know my house is always open for guests. Look! Mmm! And I don't know if you realize, but it is huge! It is Monday and we're gonna watch the first horror movie of the season, which is called... C'est quoi? The Collector. The Collector! And after that I'm going to go see a friend I haven't seen in more than a year, so it's going to be a very nice, beautiful, chill day. Look at my beautiful hippie sister with blue hair and beautiful vintage clothes. You are beautiful! Donc voilà, je suis avec Bayan, mais arrête de te cacher. Hello, beautiful friend. <laughs> and it's the first time we see each other in a, in a year, actually. And yeah, it's going fine. She just went to the hairdresser today. Mais c'est très beau, hein, tes cheveux. Et aussi de comment t'es habillée, c'est trop beau aussi. Voilà. We have a fashion victim over here. Et moi, bon, comme d'habitude, le même sac. Voilà. Now we're going to go eat something. And then I'm probably going to go to the gym because I've already pack my stuff but that doesn't mean I'm going to go but at least you know I tried This is called a bourbon apparently and it comes with Je sais pas comment t'appelles the cacahuète and beef and um, on va taste. Ah mais il y a un truc que j'aime pas. Et quoi Je pense qu'il y a du gingembre. Non. Tu veux changer Attends. Je vais mélanger, je vais voir. I think it's nice but I hope there's no ginger in the in the in the dish. Est-ce que c'est bon mm -hmm. 
and I thought this would cost a little bit more but it only cost us 10 euros per dish so it's all right it is currently 8 44 and look at how dark it is I feel like dying I have just left my friend Bayan after eating like a little pig today again this is the story of my life but now to feel a little bit less guilty look where I'm headed and no I'm not talking about a pizza hut I'm talking about basic fit and what kind of monsters put a pizza hut next to a basic fit do you hate people do you hate fat people do you hate people that want to be healthy please explain so yeah today is actually a very productive day and i'm pretty proud of myself did you go to the gym today no let's be less ambitious did you go to the gym this month tell me tell me everything i can hear it it's okay we're gonna you know we're gonna be mediocre together we're all in this together na, na. okay everyone's looking at me weird i'm gonna go to the gym weird people staring at me imagine if they steal my camera I don't have the right shoes, but hey, at least I showed up, right? Look at me, I'm going to the gym. This is not something you'll see often in October. Maybe the first and last time, actually. Now I'm going to run very fast so that I can feel myself after the gym session all sweaty because I need strange approval. Okay, bye. And I'm done. I'm heading back home now and I know I look like I didn't even sweat but I swear to you I spent 30 whole minutes on the elliptical which I consider to be enough because you know a 30 minutes workout is better than a zero minutes workout. So I'm quite proud of myself. To be honest so now i'm heading back home i'm gonna take a shower because tomorrow i have online class at 8 in the morning yes you heard that right but the good thing about having online classes is that i can still attend my classes while still laying in bed and i think that's the true luxury of this whole mess that's been 2020. you need to find a light or i don't know what what Dumbledore said it's not always dark if one remembers to turn on the light something like that happiness can be found even in the darkest of times if one only remembers to turn on the light well that's how I feel about online classes hello I had my first class at 8 a.m. and look what time it is 8.28 and I'm just opening Teams so I'm going to follow, what, 30 minutes, just like yesterday's workout. A 30 minutes class is better than a zero minutes class. <laughs> See, the class has been broadcasting for one hour. And I'm going to come here like a, like a freshly bloomed flower and click join. I don't trust this, don't trust this, don't trust this. Join. <laughs> Wonderful, yes! This is gonna be fun. And look, I'm following the class while also laying in bed. That's. And also, I like it because I feel like online classes are nice background noises for when I'm editing or when I'm doing other stuff. So it's quite nice because for me to study and focus, I like to have background noises. So online classes, I know you're supposed to listen, take notes, etc. But everything is on the slides, so... Imagine if my mic is not muted. I'm gonna kill myself if it's the case. Okay, I muted my online class, which <laughs> defeats the purpose of online classes, but you know. I have just received an email saying that my Dutch class has been cancelled. But guess what? Yesterday, I was too focused on doing nothing than to do my homework. So I didn't do my homework. And now, magically, it's like the gods. They hurt me. They hurt my prayers. I like today. I like it. <laughs>
And the reason why we have this particular class online is because a maximum of 12 students are allowed in the class at the same time because of COVID guidelines. And in our group, I think we are between 25 and 30. So we divided the class into two groups and once every two weeks, we can go attend a class at school. So this week it's group one and then the following week it's gonna be group two. And while the first group attends the classes at school, we can attend it online so it's the best system we could find and it's working pretty well unless i decide to sleep in like a bear during winter of course <sighs> i don't care if people are going to be offended by this but look at the <laughs> look at the message i sent my friend to tell him <laughs> that my classes have been cancelled look at hear the happiness in my voice hello beautiful people how are you i'm setting this message I'm sending this message to tell you uh, that en fait j'ai pas école aujourd'hui. Uh, j'ai pas école à 13h néerlandais c'est cancelled et après le 15h de English c'est cancelled also. So le cours de 13h néerlandais c'est cancelled et aussi le cours de 15h English c'est cancelled also. <laughs> It's a beautiful day. Look at my cute socks though, mind you I'm 24 and a half and still wearing Ariel socks and I think I'll do this forever now. So we made dinner, this is a slice of bread with cheese and honey, merci, thank you very much. This is a salad with fried chata and this is a wrap with salmon, cheese and bell pepper. This year I need to do an internship for 15 weeks and this is the first email I send to apply for my internship. So I hope it's gonna be successful. I hope I can go to the... yeah, so I hope they're gonna pick me. But I'm really hopeful on this one. So we'll see how this goes. On Wednesday, we wear pink and also on every other day because I've been wearing this sweater for five days straight because I have no self-respect. So Wednesday is my upload day, so today, so today I'm going to edit all day and hope that I'm going to be on time because um, I, I try to be as consistent as possible with my upload but sometimes it gets hard because my laptop doesn't always followed all the editing that I have to do for my videos so I borrowed a laptop this time so I hope I'm gonna get the work done faster today it's currently 4 p.m. and I have to upload it in four hours I'm uploading the Bruges video with my best friend Nicole and I really like it so far I mean every video I make with either my friends or family I absolutely love because those videos are content for you guys but they are also memories for me so I really like them. And also, I'm going to skip my 5 p.m. class. Sorry! The sun has set. I'm late for my upload, but at least I am done. Uh, yes! It is 4 a.m. and I think you can tell. I don't know if the productive bug bit me or something, but I've actually finished editing two, two, two videos today. So I'm pretty proud of myself. That's it for the first week of October. I hope you liked it. If you did, don't forget to drop a like and tell me in the comments down below what, uh, what? And tell me in the comments down below if you like the fact that I'm posting twice a week for this whole month or not, if it's too much, if you like Vlogtober, I know I didn't do much, but I don't know, I have a simple life, what can I say? Don't judge me. If you like my bubbly personality, don't forget to subscribe, I post one video a week every Wednesday 8pm, GM2 plus 2, and every Friday or every Saturday 8pm. <laughs> At least I'm trying, sometimes, you know, life gets in the way, but I'm trying and that's what's important in this life. So I'll see you next week, same day, same time, hopefully. Bye guys, I'm dying. I'm going to sleep now, good night.